Welcome to the instructional video for the new full auto-tuning feature of the DYN Servo system. In addition to the real-time adaptive auto-tuning built into each drive, we've created this feature to let the program determine the servo gain parameters in full. In our demo system, we're running an 880DST 750W motor coupled to a load that's about 7 times the inertia ratio. Before we begin, make sure you're familiar with the servo drive, servo motor, and DMM DRV program. Power up the system, open up the program, and we can begin. As usual, set the COM port number to achieve communication with the drive. Then open up the auto tuning module. Read through the warnings and make sure everything is followed on the system. First, select the motor being tuned. The left panel shows the list of all the standard motor models. If using a custom motor type, enter the rotor inertia and torque constant into the boxes. We're using an 880DST motor, so we'll select that. Next, we need to select the control mode to be used in the actual application. If the application uses position servo mode, select position servo mode. If speed servo mode, select speed servo mode, etc. If you don't know the final control mode yet, set to position servo mode as default. Then click continue. If the load inertia is especially low or especially high, you can tell the program accordingly for more accurate calculation. In general, select standard as a load inertia mismatch. Next, select the mechanical load type. If the motor is driving a load with any type of belt, conveyor, or chain mechanism, select belt mechanism. Otherwise, select rigid mechanism. If unknown yet, select rigid mechanism. Lastly, select the degree of torque filter to be applied. In general, select standard as default. Click continue. Click start auto tuning to start the auto tuning process. The procedure will run through a series of low frequency, high frequency, low ramp, and high ramp acceleration movements. The procedure will take 2-4 to four minutes depending on the motor and load type. The table on the top right will initially show the user selected parameters and will also display the auto tuning parameters when finished. We'll wait until the tuning procedure finishes.
Once the auto-tuning is completed, we can see the calculated parameters for the main gain, speed gain, integration gain, and torque filter. These parameters are automatically saved into the servo drive. The auto-tuning is now completed.